Yo, 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 what's good? It's your boy Token Black, man. I forgot what I was gonna say. Oh, it's your boy Token Black, aka Don Zalug. I'm gonna make sure everybody eats. It's a lot of bugs out here, so I'm gonna make this real quick, man. Uh, Damian Lillard goes to the Bucks. First of all, Heat fans, y'all mad as shit. Why are y'all so mad? It just didn't work out. I feel like this happens a lot in trades like it just didn't work out why are you guys why are they even why am i even still seeing like oh heat fans are upset oh tyler here like it just didn't work out what are y'all gonna do about it continue to cry probably all right so damian lillard to the bucks does a lot of different things what it does for Giannis is expands his playing field right so used to be able well i wouldn't say you used to be able but the fact that damian lillard can literally shoot the ball from the logo consistently gives Giannis a lot more room to work with in the paint right we all know Giannis can't shoot threes that's that's something that is known amongst the masses but it does expand you know his range from the paint to like free throw line extended right so if you double him he could throw the ball to logo lillard who's going you know what i'm saying hit that hit that hole from the three or back from beyond the three wherever it's going to be at and Giannis is already great in transition but having damian lillard again in transition transition makes it so he doesn't always have to look directly at the basket right he has options more he has better options now right and when i say better options there's i'll talk about that later but he has better options now so he doesn't have to just go directly to the basket and be trying to do all this stuff because it works early in the game but late in the game you know you can't just you can't just charge your way into the basket you can't do that late game it just it isn't a it isn't a good plan and it isn't a worthwhile plan to base your franchise on it's just Giannis just going through the oh he's stuck he throws it off the backboard and dunks it you can't live off that you can't live off that so Damian Lillard being there expands the space in which he has to work with and instead of being instead of you know backing himself into the basket where the double might come from he can actually play that one-on-one -on -one game free throw line extended and then out on the corners as well uh what this does for Damian Lillard gives him more of a chance to win a ring so that's I'm not even going to talk about that it gives him more of a chance to win a ring he's been in one spot for a very long time with other guards right with other guards uh but now he's actually has an elite big man that he can pass the ball to. And this also expands the space in which he has to work with as well because, you know, we all know he can shoot that jump shot. We all know he can shoot that three. But driving to the basket, he now has an option. When he's driving to the basket, he can throw that oop up to Giannis and he can go dunk it. Or he could do a little dump off pass, something like that. But this point guard, big man two-man game that they're gonna have is gonna be a problem for a lot of different teams you have to you have to have either two elite players a guard and a big man to be able to stop this or two elite players and somebody else right um now the bucks already have that third option that is going to be hard for a lot of teams to have an answer for and that's chris middleton I think that Chris Middleton shines more as a third option. You know, he did his thing, whatever. He was doing his thing. But have you heard about him since then? No, you haven't. Because he's not the type of player you're going to be able to put the team on his... You can't put the team on his back. You just can't. So I think he's going to shine more as that third option. Whereas if you double Lillard, he can pass it to Giannis. If you double Giannis, he can pass it to Lillard. But they both also have the option of throwing it to Chris Middleton wherever he's at on the court, whether it be in the corner or be, uh, you know, you'd want him to be on the other side of wherever Giannis and Lillard are 
playing that two-man game, but they can also dump the ball to him and he can be effective and he can be consistent in that, uh, in that third role. So wherever he's at, I know he's cheesing right now, like, oh, I'm about to get more points again. So does a lot of things for Giannis, does a lot of things for, uh, for Lillard and, and Chris Middleton. You might be hearing and seeing his name more than you would otherwise as a good third option. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Is this going to be what we think it's going to be? Do they have a chance to win a ring? Because people are saying they're already second in the runnings to win a ring after the Lakers. So let me know what y'all think, man. Yes, sir.